process here is called was named by a man by the name of Doolittle, so it's called the Doolittle Split. You do it with a, preferably with a strong hive. Prior to this, we've actually taken and shaken the bees and, the, and hopefully the queen down below this queen excluder. Normally you could do this and come back the same day and split the brood out. This one's sit here long enough that if the queen pheromone is weak enough, they'll start laying, they'll start making queen cells up here at the top. But I kind of look in here just to see if it's in the edge. And hopefully there is not. Queen cell, no, you see was, some drones, drum cells. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty classical organization. The drone cells around the outside edges. And that's also where you kind of expect to, be, to see swarm cells. So we see no signs of the queen being here. When you set high bodies down, you kind of want to set them up on the ends. That way, the frames don't rattle back and forth this way. So we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna put this one. So this is the part that we think got the queen in it. This is where she should be. So we got lots of larvae, lots of eggs. So she's down here in the bottom someplace. Do you want to pass around one of those? Just so I can see. Uh huh. Okay. So especially out here on the, on this edges, you should, you should be able to see the just hold it by the ears. By the ears. There you go. Put this tape and you can kind of you can kind of rotate you can kind of rotate it around this kind of axis like this. There she is. There's the queen right here. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, the green spot. So she's one. She's. I think she's one of those New Mexico queens. I see some larvae in there, some big ones. Mm -hmm. I yeah, see the white ones. ones. This one here's got the old queen in it. Yeah. 
close it up. So I've moved the old queen one slot over, and that's just so the a few of the field bees will end up leaving here and will end up probably populating this one. You can you can kind of take and shift them back and forth if the population gets real uneven. So this is an introductory cage. Y'all saw these before. I pulled the cork end on the candy end. And you just kind of want to slide it candy down right up as close to the brood bees as you can get them. And that's one split. So this hive has been split two ways. Old queen, new queen. And you know, it made it faster, easier. The Action. fact that he had gone through and found the token at the queen and, and put her at the bottom in preparation for this. So the idea that you just shake the bees down, you throw on a queen excluder, that just kind of seals the queen. Now the, the randomness is, is every once in a while the queen will wander outside the hive mm -hmm. and she'll walk up to the top and walk in the top entry. So it's not 100%, but anyway, th this is named after a guy by the name of Doolittle. Mm -hmm.